Hi guys, today we're gonna go through some eyeshadows that I recently purchased online. They are very beautiful spring colors, very bright. They're all shimmery, um, except for one black color. So let's get started. So the first set is um, color number 044, the black color on the left side, and the color 061, the shimmery black color on the right side. As you guys can see, the one on the left side, color 044, is a charcoal black color. It's less shimmery than the right side, 061. Um, it's really pigmented. And the other one, 061 on the right side, it's a, kind of a grayish black color, not really pure black. It's a really shimmery and beautiful color, and it's also pigmented. Okay, the next set that I'm going to compare are two beautiful pearl colors. And the one on the left side is um, um, color 056. It's a relatively darker purplish color. It's a shimmer. And the one on the right side is uh, 031. It's a relatively light purple color. It's also very shimmery. The swatches are right here. As you guys can see, like the previous group, the darker color um, in purple is actually less shimmery than the one on the right side that's a light purple color. So the one on the left, it's really pigmented. It's a kind of um, a dark purple, but not too dark. And the one on the right side, I would say even though it's called a purple shimmer, literally you see a lot of shimmer, just like a lot of pearl colors. You barely can see the purple. It's kind of, it's really, really light. You, if you have really fair skin tone, you definitely can see this on your skin. But if you, like me, have yellow undertone, you can see it kind of, but not that obvious. Next set, I have three beautiful spring green colors, and they're amazing. I know Sephora um, brought out this new set of green tone shimmers, eyeshadows, in March for the spring. And these three I bought online, they're much cheaper. And uh, they kind of look not exactly the same, but kind of similar. So let's get started. Okay, the one on the left side is uh, color 55. It's a very beautiful peacock green color. I don't know why I showed them kind of like a bluish color in the camera, but it's actually peacock green. It's very pigmented. It's not that shimmery, um, even though it's called a shimmer. Um, uh, the one in the middle is color 046. It's a very beautiful green color. Light green color. Fits the season perfectly. It's pigmented. It's more shimmery than the one on the left side. The one on the right, number 018, I would say I would never buy it again. The reason is, it's not that pigmented. And um, it's, it's this green color shimmer with a gold sh kind of like mix of gold shimmer in it. So it's appearing more like a yellowish tone, a gold gold color rather than the green for me. So I already play three layers on it and you can barely see it on my hands so it's not really pigmented. Okay, the next set is actually my favorite set. It's three beautiful bluish color shimmers. And as you guys can see, the one on the left and the middle looks kind of similar. So let's go to the swatches. As you guys can see on the swatches, they are kind of different, actually. Um, uh, the one on the left side and the one in the middle, you know, just look at the shimmers, you'd be like, oh, they look quite similar. But on the swatch, you can see the one on the left is number 44. It's a kind of very beautiful Valander bluish color, so it's kind of a purplish blue. And the one right in the middle is color 019. It's a very beautiful, like, sea blue color. Um, I would say the one on the left is more shimmery, and uh, the one right in the middle is kind of the least shimmery among the three. The one on the right side, I wouldn't recommend this too much unless it's for, like, a nightclub thing because it's not really pigmented. And as you guys can see, the shimmer is much bigger than the ones on the left side. The, the left two side ones, they have really fine shimmer. So it's really mild, you know, it's not just too much. But the one on the right side, the shimmers are quite big. So if you want to go to a nightclub, they're going to be perfect. Um, but if you're just wanting for a daily use, I wouldn't recommend it. It's a, even though it's a like really beautiful sky blue color. The next set, it's very gorgeous. Um, uh, it's um, they're all kind of pinkish tone, 
So we're gonna go start from the first one. On the swatches, as you guys can see, these three colors um are they are all pigmented. And the one on the left side is in color 011. It's a very hot pink color. It's like bright, it's gorgeous. I love, love, love it. It's a kind of shimmery, but not too much, so it's kind of like really good for daily use. The one in the middle is in color 032. It's kind of a pale pink color, so if you are like somebody with fair skin tone, it's going to show up really beautifully on you, but if you are like somebody like me, yellow undertone, it pretty much gave you a really skin color shimmer. And I would say it's a like bigger shimmer among the three, so it shines more. But I think it's gonna be perfect if you want to do a highlight somewhere um, on your eyes, maybe like under the eyebrows. Um, I would say this one is the perfect one. The one on the right side is the color 057. It's actually not that pinkish color. It's a um, it's a orangish yellow undertone. So it's very very pretty for a daily use. It's gonna go on the um, skin very smoothly. The powders are really fine and the shimmer is smaller and. Um, it just can give you this really bright and healthy look for your eyelids without bringing too much on the color or on the shimmery part. So I think this side would be great for um, eyeshadow makeup. So these are the eyeshadows that I introduced to you guys today. Um, I would say they are great because they all come in this um, mini sizes. They are kind of like the containers a little bit bigger than a quarter. They are super cheap. I bought the 12 colors um, and I paid I think $3.99. And then the seller actually gave me one as a gift that is the, kind of like the matte black color. So that's all for today's review. And if you guys have further questions, please leave a comment below. Please don't forget to subscribe up down the top if you like this review. And um, I will see you guys later. Bye.